Vote Aphrodite for your new president. When you are feeling sad, down, blue, and lonely, Aphrodite will always be there to comfort and love you, making you feel happy and loved. Unlike Zeus, who left the race a man in the dark and cold without any fire, and also cheated on his wife Hera. How could he? As your leader, I promise to be dedicated, loving, honest, helpful, and much more, making me the best choice as your new president. I'm Aphrodite, and I approve this message. Apollo, the god of the sun, is a perfect choice for president. He promises light and heat for the earth, and knowledge to man. He is very friendly, and listens to all of the citizens' concerns. He loves art, and will support everyone with their creations. Aphrodite is the god of prostitution. Hermes protects criminals and Zeus is bestial. Who wants that in a president? Vote Apollo. Everything you've ever wanted in a president. I'm Apollo and I approve this message. Athena, goddess of warfare, daughter of Zeus and Midas, Athena is the goddess of wisdom, war, arts, industry, justice, and skill. She has all the qualities of a great leader. Her accomplishments to help man are many. They include helping man invent the axe, plow, and wheel. She created numbers and science. She also created spiders after a weaving competition against a human girl in which she won. A great leader could be your leader if you vote for Athena. Hephaestus for emperor. He is always working hard for the common people. But what was Zeus doing? Well, who wasn't Zeus doing? And what about Poseidon? He tried to kill all of Athens in his jealous rage. So, don't vote for Zeus or Poseidon. They'd make things worse. Vote for me. Hermes. Hermes, Hermes, vote for Hermes. Shark. Hermes, Hermes, vote for Hermes. I'm Hermes, and I approve this message. What you looking at? Vote for Poseidon. Honest. Joyful. Powerful. Caring. I am Poseidon, and I approve this message. Choose Zeus.
Tschüss. Tschüss. I'm Zeus and I approved this message.